Ah, uh, kind of. Sorry, Ashley. I think. <laughs> I know my head. I think I know who I'm going to let die at Vermeer. I kind of. Caden's just a bit more interesting and slightly humorous, whereas Ashley just pisses me off. Uh, okay. Uh, wards. Let's go to. I haven't been there yet. Have I? Nope. We've got to walk to C sec then. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. That's all to you. Oh. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? I was on Mindwar during the Blitz. Saw you on the vids when you got your medal. You saved the whole colony. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry. I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang, Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? How do you like working here on the Citadel? This place is amazing. I've been here almost a year, and I still haven't seen a tenth of it. The Presidium is so that beautiful. Ship? Good place to go and relax. In the background. But I really like it here down in the wards. There's always something going on somewhere. Like that new club they just opened a few months ago, Flux. Wicked scene in there, Commander. You should check it out when you have some time. What do you know about the Spectres? Just the stuff they show in the vids. They always make them out to be super agents on secret missions to save the galaxy. I know it's not really like that, though. Some of the other CSEC guys don't like them too much. Figure they shouldn't be able to operate outside the law. But if they were so bad, the Council wouldn't use them, right? Why'd you join Citadel Security? I don't know. Seemed like the right thing to do, you know? Maybe it's in my blood. My grandfather was a cop back on Earth. It's kind of what CSEC is. Police for the Citadel. I'm still pretty new at it, but I like it so far. Way more interesting than staying back on Earth. You get to meet all kinds of cool aliens. Like those Hanar. Wild. Plus, CSEC gets a lot of respect here. We uphold the law. People, even aliens, appreciate that. I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. That was a nice little chat. has settled out of court with a Krogan group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan... so fucking quick. It's amazing. I'd, I'd like to see... I'd see some footage of what it's like on base consoles, original consoles, last gen. Um, because obviously a lot of that late in time is probably the SSD at the PS5 helping. Um, yeah, oh, there's Rex. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Go on. Get out of here. <laughs> Do I know you, human? My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. Uh, Shepard. Commander Shepard. Shepard, Shepard, Shepard. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. Does this mean you're part of my team, Rex? Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. <laughs> Kill. Right. Rex and Garrus, let's go. I just realized I need to probably level them two. I've got some points. Uh, pistols. And... Vanguard. And then... Okay. First aid, because it's useful to have a good amount of that. Come to that. Decryption. Yep. Tactical armor. And then one into assault rifles. I'm going to give them snipers eventually. And then Rex can have combat armor. He can have warp. 
Krog and Battlemaster and ARs. And one more to Krog and Battlemaster. Right. Let's go. Right. Starting to get the good members. Right. So, we are going to go to. Uh, the next space around. Way mission. Tay down fist. Let's go into the chorus den for that one, yep. Alright. Little TP there. Alright, here we are. Get ready for a fight. Try out the old pistol. Have I got marksman yet? Yes, I do. Okay. Let's do this. I'm sorry, don't die. Yep, this is still gone. Pistol feels really fucking nice to use. Alright, let's get. Do you want to set up for everyone or just me? I know it's everyone. Okay. Let's just hit him with everything. Gameplay is really improved. It just feels really nice. I'm actually enjoying gameplay. Oh, bloody hell. That, that car has been doing it two or three times today. That's why. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot. This would be a good time to find somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good idea. Yeah, I never like fist anyway. <laughs> it would have been quicker to just kill them. <clears throat> Shooting people isn't always the answer. Okay. We got shotgun and a sniper. Let's take them off now. Look out! Oh, sabotage that fucker. And they're gonna warp him. I'm gonna also warp him myself. Is throw on the fucker. Yeah. Don't kill me, I surrender. Where's the quarian? She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait. I don't know where the quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The quarian isn't here. Said she'd only deal with the shadow broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker, ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. 
Tell me where that meeting is before I blow your lying head off. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. What are you doing? The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. We don't shoot unarmed prisoners. How many people died because of him? He brought this on himself. Besides, we have more pressing concerns. That quarian's dead if we don't go now. All right, let's go. Let's take whatever's in there. I think I just did. It's okay. Yeah, I never understood that line. I don't know where the quarian is, but I know where you can where you can find her. It's a weird line. Warp, we'll throw you. Warp you. Rex can warp you. Get to put on overkill. And I'll get some marks. Fucking amazing. I never really used it much in Mass Effect. I'll probably do that more this gameplay, this playthrough. Certainly in two. When I start doing like the charge attack the Vanguard gets and stuff and shotgun them in the face and stuff. Right, let's move up. I swear it's down here. Oh no, it's up here, isn't it? Of course. I thought it was I thought this hallway was there. Broker, where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Oh, my God, fucked him up. Lock on. Here on. Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards and <laughs> all out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many? Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? This Quarian can help us bring down Saren. I would have told you that if you hadn't jumped down my throat. I apologize, Commander. This whole thing with Saren has me a bit on edge. Maybe we should just start at the beginning, Miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. 
Through our pilgrimage, we prove that we will contribute to the community, rather than being a burden on our limited resources. <clears throat> Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. Saren won't get out of this one. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. <laughs> this is a lot to handle. They might just ignore everything we tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audio files prove Saren's a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian? My name is Tolly. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Sweet. And he got the hard to go, we got the full squad. I'm gonna take Ah ba, 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 ba. Tally. Good for shields and that. And Rex for a bit of biotics and pure damage. Go with that for now. Okay. I might switch to Gliara, maybe, for a bit for pure biotic. Maybe. We'll see. Right. Okay. I'm trying to remember now. I think that quest might unlock the family one. Yep, yeah, this guy. I'm trying to remember when it's unlocked. Commander Shepard, could you spare a moment of your time? Commander Shepard, my name is Samesh Bhatia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. It's no trouble. What can I do for you? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. We'll look into it. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. Okay. Right. Up here we go. Ooh. 
Oh, so there's another quest here potentially. Or is that just this? Oh no, it's this one. My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. Your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? Yes. A man named Samesh Batya is having some trouble claiming his wife's body. Ah, Mr. Batya. A good man in an understandably frustrating position. I wish I could help him. Serviceman Nirali Batia died on Eden Prime, as Mr. Batia no doubt told you. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. You're studying her injuries to learn more about Geth weaponry. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Batia may save more lives in death than she did in life. Oh, fuck. I do see his point. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. I understand what you're trying to do, but holding the body is wrong. Commander, you of all people should understand how far we must go to protect humanity. Is this what I'm out there fighting for? A government that steals the bodies of its honored dead? That's not the reaction I thought it was going to be. You win. It was hard enough refusing Mr. Batia. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing you. Tell Samesh that the body is being shipped back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. Right. Can I talk to you now? I don't have time nope. to talk now. I'm very busy. Show me how that quest starts. Oh, let's let him know. What is that? Oh, the leaves. Okay, it's all the black things. Weirdly textured. Hello again, Commander. Has there been any word? I reminded Mr. Bosker what we're fighting for. Your wife is coming home. Thank you. I will return home and begin my preparations. It does not bring me happiness, but it may bring me peace. Goodbye, Commander. Okay, okay, that's that done. Right, uh, so, what we got? That one. That's all going. Oh, okay, deliver that. Go to upper wards, okay, I'll do that. And return to the tower to talk to the counts about that. Right, I'm going to go do that then. Um, so I'll go there. Just need to level. Oh, I've got level points myself. Okay, I'm going to go with. Salt training and warp. Give myself barrier. Could be useful. Uh, Rex. Max X Craig and Battle Master. And Tally. Um, electronics a few. Damping. What's that one? Oh, it's overload. Yep, fuck it. Encryption. Dampening. What's dampening do? Hmm, could be useful. Give a two into that, a few into that, a couple into armor, one into pistols, four. Okie dokie, let's go. Right, to the walls. Make that, yeah, we just, just turn right and go out then, can't we? I might go to make it actually because I think about it. I think there's another quest you can get from her or something. Possibly. I never properly thanked you for saving me from Fist's thugs, Commander. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't been there. I'm just glad you weren't hurt. Me too. Now, was there anything you needed? I'll be going now. Okay. Goodbye, Maybe it's later on. Right, where is Emily Wong? Is she still? Yep, looks like it. Where the hell? Proceeded. Where the hell is the flux? Oh, it's up there. Okay. Word on the street is that you've been busy. 
Congratulations on taking down Fist. I was sure he was a big player in anything going on here. Did you find anything in his office that could help me? These OSDs might have the information you're looking for. <laughs> You've got Fist's files? This could be even bigger than I'd hoped. Here, Commander, for your trouble. What would my future cooperation be worth? Say, an interview when my investigation is over? Exclusive? You talk to me before you talk to anyone else? That would be worth quite a bit, and I'd be very happy to compensate you accordingly. Here you are. Cool. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go see what's on these discs. Awesome. Little bonus. Right. Let's go to Flux. Um, there is a side quest here, I think. Something to do with the barmaid at Chorus or something. That music. Can I dance it? Why can I dance? Oh, what? There's no dance option. Damn it. to dance a little when the mood strikes me <laughs> we've got some quasar stations uh, if you're interested goodbye enjoy your time sorry I'm kind of busy right now so uh, what can I do for you what were you discussing with the Volus who Doran oh uh, I was just asking him about my sister see she worked for Doran before she left too Ugh, sorry I don't want to bore you with my problems I'm interested to hear what you have to say well, okay. My sister Jenna left here to go work at Cora's Den. The problem is, she's working as an informant for CSEC. You know, eavesdropping on the people there. If they find out what she's doing, they'll kill her. I assume CSEC is protecting her? They can't watch her all the time. Mm, I don't know. Sometimes I think she stays there just to spite me. Do you know who her contact at CSEC is? No. It's all very secret. Last time I asked an officer, he told me to stay out of it, for Jenna's safety. Maybe I could help her understand just how dangerous Cora's Den is. Would you? That'd be great. Just don't tell her I sent you. Well, I should get back to work before I get in trouble. <laughs> Thanks. Go to that in a minute. Oh, wow. That's your decent reflections on the wind, don't they? Are a little bit jittery. But still, it just it adds something. That's cool. Still annoyed I can't dance. Yeah, I'm certainly. I swear you can dance. Maybe it's later on. Keep my bloody weapons out by accident. I'm waiting for someone else. Let's have a little go on this, shall we? I can't remember what you get. Got to get to. Oh fuck! It was a certain number, wasn't it? I think it was 20. Alright, oh, sweet. Yeah, it's 20, you'll get to. Okay. Mm, do I risk it? Do I risk it? Fuck it. Bollocks. One more go. Go to Cora's Den then. Do that quest. 